on. A celebration of tri-state women coming up in August. Ella Johnson is here with Jan Davies, and they're here to tell us the story behind Women's Equality Day, and I hope to get to be there this yeah. year. Oh, you yes. come, please. When did this begin? Well, it began 16 years ago, and since that time, there's been a, a group of concerned women, citizens, just anyone, <laughs> even you can join the group, <laughs> and we <laughs> plan an annual celebration to co uh, commemorate the um, women receiving the right to vote, earning the right to work or vote. We yes. worked hard to achieve we that. Sure we fought did. for the right yeah, to vote. Yeah, we fought to Absolutely. the right. Absolutely. And, yeah. and we see this as an opportunity to really honor our past, you know, and to uh, have a better understanding of how we as women have advanced uh, through our uh, status or whatever in this and country. And continue to advance. And Absolutely. continue to advance. Yeah. Well, and what our, are all the details about the big day? Well, we, it's going to be on August the 24th, and it's going to be 11.30 a.m. And she will be speaking with us about our guest speaker, but it's our 16th one, as I said earlier. We, are, we have tickets on sale, $30 per person. We also have sponsorship opportunities where you can get Those always help. If for you all sponsor. your friends yes, to come. And um, it's going to be, don't miss it. It's going to yeah. be interesting. It's going to be very interesting. interesting. The speaker will be good. And, and let's talk about the speaker. What is her name? Our speaker is Rabbi Sandy Sasso, and she's a very uh, interesting woman. Uh, she is the first female rabbi of the Judaism reform, reform, reform yeah. movement. Uh -huh. So she's going to be speaking to us. She got involved, and she wanted to become a rabbi very early on and said that when she was 16 years old, went to school, met her husband there. He is also a rabbi, so together they are the first rabbi couple in the world. So that's very interesting. She's a, a children's author, wrote a, a several books about children and religion, and she's experienced a lot of firsts in her life in her career and in her religion. So she's going to talk to us about that. Well, anytime somebody is that sort of pioneer that breaks forth in a, in a field, in, in religious right. fields across the globe, have not always been women friendly. So that's a powerful story. Right, right. And so we're looking forward to hearing from her. What right. about some of the awards you're going to be handing out this year? Well, we recognize a women, a local woman, every year. But this year we're doing something a little bit different. We're doing it two, two awards. And we're having, the, for the first time, we're calling it the Unsung Hero Award. There are a lot of women that do things behind the scene, and they're always there. They're dedicated. But they're not really the face of a movement or an event. But you couldn't get it done without their involvement. So we want to recognize the unsung heroes out there. And we're also going to be recognizing our inspirational leader. That's a woman who has just out there blazing trails, making a difference, you know, kind of doing things where no one has done them before. And just, you know, we want to, uh, to recognize her for her inspiration. If someone is watching and they think, I know somebody I'd like to nominate for next year, how do we do that? Right. The nomination forms are on, online. online. If you go to steppingupevv.com, you can get the forms. The information is all there. You can fill that information out, mail those in to Jan Davies. Her information is there. And they'll show, they'll show you how you can look for the information, uh, what you need to provide to, to a nominate somebody. For that somebody. person right, that you want right. to nominate. Yes, and at any time, you can submit a, a, a nomination for next year. So if someone's very inspired after this luncheon and finds out who the winner is, be sure and uh, don't let it pass. Take the opportunity right. and send it in now. Right. And one other thing could I add, there have been a lot of women that have been nominated in the past and they didn't receive the award. And we are encouraging those who have nominated somebody in the past to renominate those women yes. again. We'd like to yeah. see some of those women yeah. renominated right. because there's been some outstanding women that have been uh, nominated for an award. And unfortunately, we're, we're only giving one. Now we're giving two and hopefully we can recognize more women in the future. Well, it's going to be a powerful event and an important one, celebrating women in our own community. Do we get our tickets from Stepping Up as well? You uh, can get them uh, online. online. Okay. Or at the YWCA, right, you can get yeah. them. All right. Well, Jan and Ella, thank you both so thank much. You. Thank you. So much. Women's Equality it. Day coming up on August 24th. Get your tickets. And when we come back, we're going to meet Jill Larkin of Optimal Escape. We're going to find out.